hi everyone hope all of you are doing great and welcome back to the complete api development course in this course we are going to build a complete api from scratch for our e-commerce project and this api will have all the modern technologies higher security and many more most of the functionality which you have seen in e-commerce platforms like amazon and Flipkart, that's all we're going to include in this api so i think this is going to be one of the best api course you will find on entire youtube so let me give you a quick overview that what are the functionality we're going to add into our api and how you can use it so the very first section we're going to build our api with all those http requests get post update delete and create then we'll move to the user section where we'll allow user to create their account in three different parts one as an admin moderator and user and on the base of their role they will have accessibility on the entire website so we'll also focus on authorization so we're going to protect certain pages certain information for certain user you will find that how you can do that and in the third section we're going to build the review section review model so most of the time you have seen that in an e-commerce platform they have a section of review where all the informations are hold about the about the person who gave the review how much star you have given and how to calculate all those things with the aggregate pipeline and the technology i'm using for this api is mongodb because that's make our luck a lot of easy and provide higher security mongodb for building this api and in the fourth section we're going to add security where we'll use jwp token package of npn and provide higher security we're going to protect the password because sometimes what's happened that you have a password of your user in your database but somehow the hackers get into the database and they can easily able to see the password if you put as it is so we're going to find we're going to learn that how we can use the bcrypt package to encrypt the they encrypt the password of the users to provide higher security we're going to learn about the jwp token so we can easily able to identify that how what what are the accesses we are providing to the users on the base of their role so a tons of things you're going to be able to find in this complete api development course so so i make sure you should watch this complete tutorial and you will learn a lot of things about the mongodb that how you have to work the cloud with servers how you can create your own api for any type of project so this project is for e-commerce so a lot of complexities are there so if you do the same thing in other project like for consultancy subscription model you can do all those things so i've tried to include everything possible in this api development course so hope you will enjoy it so that's it for the overview now let me take you to the postman the tool we're going to use for this api development tutorial where we're going to do all the testing so i have already built the api and let me give you a quick overview that what are the things we have included in this api so let me open the postman and this is a tool which i'm going to use for doing all the testing of all the apis all the authorization user account data updating data updating deleting and posting that's all we're going to do here and once we're done with the entire api we're going to connect with our live website which i have built this one so this is the complete e-commerce website which i have built only for this project so you can see this is the home section let's come back here so this is the home section beautiful animations is going on as you can see so this is the e-commerce website for which we are building this api we have all this functionality over effect so over effect we having so beautiful animations so everything is working fine we have a review section this is the blog sections and this is the footer sections so let me reload the page and let me show you how it looks so we have an animation on the top in the nav bar and i'm still working on this template because i have to add the animation on all these things so you talk about you will learn a lot of things about these animations and i have also built the shop page so this is how the shop page will look like and here we have a different category so all the product which will mark in our api so if someone wants to have a watch and i they can click here and as you can see this radio button this is a custom radio button which i have designed for this project only so from here they can easily able to have eyewears and all those things and we have a beautiful animations going on in all those things so they can select and they can have it so this is the shop page and here we have a let's come back here and let me show you the product page because i think i have built that one as well so let's come to the main page and here i have this so this is the product page so all these data which you can see right this moment i have hard coded this but this will come through the api so 
all all these will come dynamically so all this review will get updated dynamically all this pricings here we have tabs all the details all these tab details and information is going to change dynamically with our api so here you can see someone can review you can, see, you can select and give their name email and they can update and we'll have that all into our mongodb database so here as you can see i have already created the users i'm having some user database here so that's all we're going to find it out in this complete api development tutorial so first i'm going to build the api and after that if you guys want i can easily able to show you that how you can design this template from scratch or i will show you that how you can easily have the data from the api into this website so the, the feedback i will get from all of you on the base of that i will decide to make a tutorial on this entire template or simply feed the data from our api so that's the complete overview of what we're going to build in this complete api development tutorial so the very first section we're going to build the api and that's also i have divided in a couple of sections so the first section is going to all about data so all about the data which we're going to design the models for the request post request update deletes that's all then we'll move to the user section then we will move to the so first is going to be the data second is going to be the error handling because that is one of the most important things that you have to know that how you have to handle the error from from database from user request then move to the user part then we'll move to the authorizations then we'll move to the higher security jwp token then we will move to the payment integration to the west website then we'll move to the payment integration so that's a tons of thing is coming into this course so hope you would like it that's it in this video that's it in this video in the next video i will give you a complete overview of postman the tool we're going to use for this api development without this tool it's not possible to do all the testing which we want to do to our api so hope you will find this video valuable and i will see you in that video where i will explain everything about the postman so let's get into that